it has been a while since I've posted anything on YouTube, I gotta admit, I am best at procrastinating. So basically, I am taking CDs and just painting them and seeing what happens. I saw this, like, was, I didn't know it was a thing, but then I saw it one day and I was like, that's kind of cool. And then I remembered, we have a lot of old CDs around our house. So why not paint them, put them to use, make something really cool out of them. So I actually really like how they turned out. So yeah, let's just get into the video. So for the first one I did, it's like a rainbow with clouds. Very like stereotypical aesthetic, I don't know. But I thought it was really cool. I saw this like somewhere. I really don't remember who it was from, so not really my original design, but still turned out cool. For the second one, I wanted to do something like vintage, retro, because it's a CD. It's got, it has to have something that's like retro in it. So it was so hard to fill in these lines because I hate drawing straight lines. It's, they're not even straight. I hate drawing lines in general, and I just kind of messed up too on the pattern. But yeah. It also was so hard to fill it, fill the whole thing in with like the tiny Posca pens, so that took forever as well. But then eventually I just switched to a brush because it was just easier. You see now I just blotted it all on the CD and then just blended it out with a brush. So then I added some outlines because I thought that the just the three colors would be kind of boring. So I just added a little bit of outline with different colors, still kind of like matching the colors though. I ended up adding some stars because I thought just the colors were boring. I did forget to take a final shot of the CD, so you're just going to have to see it at the end. I did end up adding a black border to the stars. So now for this next one, I wanted to do a galaxy because I love painting galaxies. Galaxies are one of my favorite things to paint. That's just essentially me trying to blend it out. I did end up adding like a third thing of color. I don't even know what they're called. Galaxy, I don't know. Then I added stars and then I added some thicker stars with a Posca pen to add like the different kinds of stars. And finally this one, I wanted to do like color, I wanted to do more colors and kind of like a more realistic one. So I'm just trying to do a sunset with some mountains. So that'll be interesting. Now I'm adding the mountains, just like some basic black mountains because like it's a sunset, you don't really need to add too much detail. Then I added some clouds because I felt like it needed something more. Thank you so much for watching, and if you like this video, please give a thumbs up. If you like my channel, please subscribe, and until next time.